Hi folks, Max from GalaxyS4Root.com. Uh, here's a quick update on the uh, T-Mobile Galaxy S4 uh, Android 4.4.2. Now for those of you still on Jelly Bean, um, I highly suggest not doing um, the the uh, upgrade uh, via OTA over the air um, because if you do that, um, there's a lot of problems. You may not be able to go back to Jelly Bean ROMs. Um, there is a stock rooted ROM uh, by XDA user Fenny that you can get uh, that will allow you to install it using Clockwork Mod Recovery. Uh, this is pretty much Android 4.4.2 but it's the Odex um, and uh, you'll be able to experience everything with 4.4.2. This is a completely stock ROM. Um, also it does come with root uh, which is nice uh, with Super SE working out of the box. Also uh, one thing about installing 4.4.2 KitKat TouchWiz ROMs on uh, Jelly Bean base, or if you're on the older uh, 4.2.2 uh, MDL base bootloader, um, the Wi Fi not might reset every time you connect. Um, so, there's an easy way to fix this just get build prop editor uh, and then go ahead and open it and go all the way down um, to RO uh, security secure storage dot support. Um, go ahead and make that false, it'll be true and then reboot and after that your Wi-Fi will work fine um, other than that, those issues everything works fine um, uh, actually uh, Fenny tells you to actually install the Wi-Fi patch but it's actually pretty much the same thing what I just showed you so you can install the patch or you can do the build prop editor um, your phone will work fine after that and you can actually install this um, on GTI 9505 I've actually got it installed on my GTI 95 05, this is a GTI 9505, and you'll see my baseband is actually i9505. So you can try uh, installing this also on GTI 9505. If you have an AT&T with an older bootloader, um, if you're still on low keyed version, then you can also install it on there, or Canadian. Um, why, why would you want to do that? Perhaps you want to, you know, maybe you have a, a T-Mobile SIM card and you want to enable Wi-Fi calling. Um, you can actually use Wi-Fi calling regardless of what kind of phone you have. So that could be one reason. Anyway, just check it out. This is a complete stock ROM. Um, and uh, yeah, do let me know what you think. Um, and uh, yeah, check this out. Also, there's ROM of the Week. Uh, I believe that was, was that Bean Stock ROM? Um, so check that out also if you want, if you want to go AOSP. Uh, but there should be a ton of more great ROMs. Sorry, that's Gummy ROM. Um, check that out also. Uh, but for this week, the rooted stock ROM is available for those of you who want to install it using Clock for My Recovery instead of unrooting. This is my recommended method. Um, that way you don't lose your older bootloader, uh, which is far more compatible um, than all this knock stuff Samsung has been putting. Um, just kind of putting me off there. But yeah, that's about it. Um, try out the latest 4.4.2 if you have a T-Mobile Galaxy S4. Also, you can install it on GTI 9505. But I will have another ROM coming later today for GTI 9505. When I'm light, uh, also Android 4.4.2, I would suggest using that. Uh, or this, I mean, you know, this is T-Mobile branded, so you get all the nice T-Mobile um, bloatware. <laughs> anyway, see y'all later. I'll stay hoy on Android.